What is up everyone, this is MoGaming here today I'm going to show you how to fix the Battlefield 6 insufficient VRAM error that you may be getting. So let's get right into this. So if you're getting this specific error, there's a, two ways to fix this. Um, for the NVIDIA graphic card that you may have, I think you can do something similar with AMD, I'm not 100% sure, but definitely for NVIDIA, what you need to do is go into graphics settings, go to the program settings, go over onto the game itself, like you see such as such over here. And in here, you're going to essentially override certain factors into the settings component over here which is essentially where it says override super resolution more which you, have, you need the 3d application settings once you have that obviously over here you can essentially override this resolution and have the highest performance one essentially being used so that essentially you're updating the graphic components over here to be able to do what you need to to be able to essentially play the game the next thing you can do is under the search bar just type in graphic settings which is opens up the window section of it i would recommend doing both essentially simultaneously same thing put the game in here what you can essentially get the game's uh, source file like as you can see over here the path put the path in there and then go into options and change it to high performance the reason you don't have like you probably have the vram is just not being allocated sufficiently because windows is putting it somewhere else so you need to redirect it to the game itself which is basically by doing those two things first from the graphic card settings itself and then second from windows settings itself do this as well save it try to turn the game you should be good to go and not have that error persist any longer so yeah that's basically it. If you guys are a video, please do something. Make sure to subscribe, click that notification bell. I'm going out. Peace.